heading to West Virginia to enjoy the great outdoors? Don't leave out these hip stops where you can enjoy everything from live music to moonshine. Take a walk down East Avenue in Thomas, West Virginia, and you'll find art galleries mixed with the antique stores, locally owned restaurants, and even a longtime live music venue. A lot of people come to this area for outdoor adventures, and then at the end of the day, when they're done, they want to have a good meal and enjoy some entertainment. So they come to the mountain towns of Thomas and Davis, and they come to places like this, the Purple Fiddle. Since 2001, the Purple Fiddle has been welcoming live acts, like the Italian rock band that played on my visit. And the town's shops and entertainment venues aren't the only entertaining attractions. Cooper House Bed and Cocktail is a cute B&B where you may be welcomed by a four-legged friend, and each room is unique. Fayetteville is another small town that's big on adventure and big on restaurants. Local Kenny Parker, who moved here for the rock climbing and opened up a climbing retail store, fills me in on the local scene. Well, you definitely want to hit the river. You want to get on the river. You want to go whitewater rafting or rock climbing or whatever your activity you're having doing out there in that beautiful gorge. You know, you're going to end up back in Fayetteville and you're going to go eat one of these good restaurants, have a beer, you know, maybe go do some shopping. You know, it's a great place to hang after you've been playing all day. So. Yeah, and soak in the local vibe. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you can head to Charlestown for more than just the races. Make a stop at Blue Murray Distillery family-run business where homemade cordials and spirits include inventive and surprising flavors like black walnut, peach, pumpkin spice, and limoncello. The distillery is open for tours and tastings. I studied abroad in Italy, had the limoncello, and I make it every Christmas now, so I'm excited to try this one to see how they match up. I'm sure yours is a lot better. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I, I, won't, I won't discredit your, your work, but yeah. it's a perfect sound. <laughs> There you go. Okay. Oh, it smells good. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's some good limoncello. A little Certainly bit is. of Italy here in West Virginia. That's right. <laughs> um, now we do hand zest every single lemon that goes into our limoncello, and we do grow lemons here right on the property. We're the farthest north that lemons are grown commercially. Wow. So mm -hmm. a lot of you know tender love and care going into this lemon. Certainly, certainly. We are a farm to glass distillery, so we grow a lot of what goes into the product. I'm not hand growing my lemons yet, but maybe <laughs> I'll get there. <laughs> one day, one day. Best of all, each of these stops is close to lots of outdoor recreation activities, so you can enjoy the best of both worlds in West Virginia.